It's time for our daily devotion, daily daily of abiding in Jesus Christ. In the book of John chapter 15 verse 7. If ye abide in me, and my words abide in you, ye shall ask what ye will, and it shall be done unto you. A daily devotional ministry project of Christo Dojino Gaga from passages taken from the Holy Scriptures with quotations from the Spirit of Prophecy by Ellen G. White. Daily, daily, daily abiding in Jesus Christ. July 6, 2020 Ephesians 3 verses 17 to 19 That Christ may dwell in your hearts by faith, that yet, being rooted and grounded in love, may be able to comprehend with all saints what is the breadth and length and depth and height, and to know the love of Christ, which passeth knowledge that ye might be filled with all the fullness of God. Quotation from the Spirit of Prophecy Truth in Christ and through Christ is measureless. The student of scripture looks, as it were, into a fountain that deepens and broadens as he gazes into its depths. Not in this life shall we comprehend the mystery of God's love in giving his Son to be the propitiation for our sins. The work of our Redeemer on this earth is and ever will be a subject that will put to the stretch our highest imagination. Man may tax every mental power in the endeavor to fathom this mystery, but his mind will become faint and weary. The most diligent searcher will see before him a boundless, shoreless sea. The truth as it is in Jesus can be experienced, but never explained. Its height and breadth and depth pass our knowledge. We may task our imagination to the utmost, and then we shall see only dimly the outlines of a love that is unexplainable, that is as high as heaven, but that stooped to the earth to stamp the image of God on all mankind. By Ellen White, Christ Object Lessons, pages 128 and 129. Our prayer for you today. Dear God our Father in heaven, with utmost humility and ultimate joy and gratitude for the assurance of the indwelling of Jesus Christ in our hearts, that we approach your holy presence. Today, we pray for the reality of the indwelling of Jesus Christ in our individual hearts and grounded in his love. Thank you for answering our prayer because we ask you in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen.